Here we go. Ten questions, Mr. Music, and here right. we go. All right. Uh, by the way, you'll be either you'll be either a, a, a bell or a buzzer, depending on your right or wrong. Okay. okay. Question one. You won four state championships with Lone Peak High School. Which four teams did the Knights defeat to win their four titles? You have to get all four correctly. AF my freshman year. Uh, Brighton my sophomore year. Alta my junior year. And PG my senior year. Oh, Way to go, right. nicely done. Good. <laughs> All right, against which team did you set your BYU career scoring high of 29 points in a single game? Is that Gonzaga? Gonzaga, yes, way to go. Good job, two for two. Between your dad, Marty, and your brother, Tyler, how many 40-point games did they account for in their BYU careers, 40 points or more? Uh, <laughs> I'm going to go with four. <laughs> I knew that. It's three. Three. Tyler had two, and Marty had one, right on the 40. By the way, in Marty's 40 point game, he was nuts. He was 16 for 19 from the field in his 40 point, and made all of his free throws. Uh, okay, question four. <laughs> this actor portrayed Captain Kirk on Star Trek and TV cop TJ Hooker in the 1980s. Who is he? Oh man, I don't even know. <laughs> Already white flag in this one. Yeah, no idea. I have no idea. William Shatner. William, William Shatner. Shatner. He was Captain Kirk, and then T.J. Hooker. We had to go for the T.J. Hook. All right. Uh, question five. You're two of four. Two and two. Uh, question five. You finished your high school career as the twelfth leading scorer in Utah Preps hoops history. To the nearest round number, how many points did you score at Lone Peak over four years? To the nearest hundred, we'll say. 1700 maybe? Gosh, I don't know. 1896 is the answer, so 1900 would have been appropriate, even 1800, but we're being a little hard on you. Okay, uh, <laughs> two correct. Uh, the city of Lyon, France. You went on a mission too? Yes. Lyon, France. Uh, the city of Lyon sits at the junction of which two rivers? The Rhone and the Seine. Oh, well, way to go. <laughs> Question seven. You wore jersey number 11 at Lone Peak. Why did you choose jersey number 30 at BYU? 11 wasn't available, <laughs> and 30. <laughs> <laughs> We're really easy on the other yeah, side. Yeah, seriously. And, and, and my favorite player is Stephen Curry, okay. so I like 30. Him. All right, so you're up to four right, I think, right? Yep. Uh, question eight. Your dad, Marty, competed in the 1987 NCAA Track and Field Championship. In which event? Uh, was it the 200? <laughs> All right. What was See, it, Marty? The 4 by 100 I'm blaming him on that one. Because <laughs> he never, he never he talks talk about, about He never talks about anything he does. Marty was in the NCAA track and field I championship know. and the 4 by one That's crazy. You'd never he was know. so talented. All right. Uh, question nine. Who is the youngest player by age? Who's the youngest player on the current BYU roster? Um, is it? It's Rylan, right? Yoli. It's Yoli. Yeah, yeah, second thought. Yoli. Yeah, Rylan had a year of prep school, a bit of a separation there. Yoli's still the youngest. And lastly, number 10, you're going to get this one right. Earlier we learned that the T in TJ stands for Tyson. What does the J stand for? It's just J, J A Y. There you go. Okay. That's this week's 10 questions. TJ, nicely done. Way to go. Uh, are we going to update the leaderboard on this one? Did they, did they keep score enough back in the control room to update the leaderboard here? And. Uh, uh, yeah, well, yeah, again, you know, but uh, we're just early in the season. You may, you know, I, I'm, not, I'm not saying you're going to end up second, but you may not end up last. So <laughs> let's just hope for that. All right. Thank you, TJ.